Hi, I am Charlotte Lawson, a registered and licensed dietitian here in Tampa Bay, Florida. You might be looking for some answers on how to reduce the amount of phytic acid in certain foods. Well, phytic acid is found in our nuts, our seeds, and legumes, and sometimes can actually prevent us from absorbing the vitamins and minerals found in these same foods. Now, there's been a little bit of research showing that sometimes soaking things before eating them, for instance, your beans or soaking seeds, about 24 hours before using them actually helps to break down that phytic acid and release and help absorb our bo or have our body absorb the minerals and vitamins in those beans and seeds. Also, different time, um, types of things like baking items. Sometimes that helps to remove uh, um, the phytic acid in some of the whole grains that we have and, again, allows things to be better absorbed. But keep in mind, if you're eating a well-rounded diet with your fruits and vegetables, your whole grains, your proteins and dairies, you're getting an abundance of vitamins and minerals as well. So just because you don't absorb them fully from one source doesn't mean that at a different time or at a different place you're absorbing that same nutrients. Moderation is really key here, and you shouldn't be so worried about removing certain things from one product as maybe you are as increasing the variety and the types of foods that you eat. If you are really concerned, you can always check into a multivitamin and mineral supplement. Try not to go over 100% of your daily value, as our body just doesn't really need it. Those are just a couple tips on how to ultimately get the best out of the foods that you eat. I'm Charlotte, and eat happy.